So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in registry editor. Click on it and then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you can follow everything I'll be doing up here. So first you wanna expand HG current user and then you want to expand software and then you want to expand Microsoft and now you want to look for Office. So you're gonna scroll down and find Office, you wanna expand Office and now this will appear. And now if you look where I just put on screen right now, since my number is 16, it means I'm using Outlook 2016. If your number is 15, it means you're using Outlook 2013. If your number is 14, you're using Outlook 2010. If your number is 12, you're using Outlook 2007. If you're using 11, it means you're using Outlook 2003. If you're using Outlook 2019, it should also be the number 16. But I'm not 100% sure on this, but it should be that. If you have a different number which is higher than 16, then it's most likely that one. And now once you're on here, you want to expand your number and you want to look for a folder that's called Outlook. If you do not see Outlook, then you want to right click on your number and then click on new and then click on key. You want to name this as Outlook and then click on enter. And now once you have the Outlook folder, you want to expand Outlook. Then you should have a folder that's called PST. If you do not have PST, then you want to right click on Outlook and then click on new and then click on key. You want to name this as PST and then click on enter. And now you want to click on the PST folder and now once you're here on the right hand side, you want to right click and then click on new and then click on DWORD 32 bit value. You're gonna name this as max large file size. Spell it the exact same way how I did with the same capitals and lowercase with no space and then click on enter. And now you're gonna do that again. So you're gonna right click and then click on new and then click on deal with to bit value. You want to name this as worn large file size. Again, same capitals and lowercase and with no space and same spelling and then click on enter. And now once you're on this, you're gonna double click on max large file size. And now this will come up. You're gonna set the base to decimal and in the value data, you want to type in 102400 and then click on OK. And now you want to double click on one large file size. And then you want to set the base to decimal and then make the value data 97280 and then click on OK. And now once you've done that, you just want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.